that's not really there yours. You what no, Alex? Like, Wait. Oh, she just <laughs> put it on Sammy. Near Sammy. You're great. Don't you touch me. What do you think? Ah! The Woody Show. All right. Weekend cheers and jeers. Uh, mine very simple. Mm-hmm. Uh, cheers to uh, a couple things I watched. I finally watched that uh, Becoming Warren Buffett oh, yeah. documentary. It's yeah, on yeah, HBO. About that, yeah. yeah, it was really was interesting. It? I mean, it's fascinating what that guy had built. Yeah. And he built mm-hmm. it from nothing. Do you feel like it gave you any tips on how you do No, I mean, it's just like he's just one of these guys who just accomplished so much. Yeah. And he started selling Coca-Cola door to door as a Amazing. kid. And like gum mm-hmm. and kind of random stuff. That and is random. He says the eighth wonder of the world is compound interest, <laughs> yeah. which is which is true. Nice. But like all the stuff that he owns, I mean, he owns yeah. like Dairy Queen and Geico. What? And, huh. Yeah. And he was a Berkshire gum sales. Berkshire Hathaway. <laughs> they're the they're the company behind yeah, all these. Right. Yeah, it's like pretty. Even the way he got Berkshire Hathaway, it wasn't. He didn't start that. He bought the company that were doing something completely different. It was really interesting. Wow. He's a poster child for living below your means and what it can accomplish. Oh, yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. And then the other thing um, uh, the other thing that I watched was uh, that Sopranos. Me too. That was really good too. It was awesome. It was, basically it was a, like behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, it's basically it's just David a, Chase. a one-on-one with David Chase, the creator of it. But like just kind of his little backstory and then how the Sopranos came together and the casting and then the stuff that, that went great. on like while the show was on the air. I wonder if I should give that another try. I watched Sopranos? episode one of The Sopranos. I'm like, That's this it? is such a bore. Oh, wow. What? Yeah. Yeah, I hated it. What a great show. Wait, from the man who said nobody can say that Breaking Bad was hard to watch, you couldn't watch Sopranos? <gasps> Breaking Bad was A plus 100% from <laughs> frame <laughs> one yeah. until the final frame. And also <laughs> Sopranos. Yeah. No, not so much. Uh, Whoa. And then my jeers is to uh, to parenting, to parenthood. Uh-oh. Uh, mm-hmm. You know, just, it's, it's, it's true. It's like normal stuff, but it's like, you know, uh, parents, uh, it's, it's it's problems at different stages, right? So the smaller the kid, the smaller the problem, the bigger the kid, the bigger the problem. Right. Mm-hmm. And so now the kids are, you know, 15 and, and 12. Mm-hmm. It just becomes like, do I really want to deal with this? Do I really want to have this conversation? Are we really talking about, you know, it's yeah. just, it, it's annoyances and yeah. know-it-alls. and I thought you were going to get into a good place at this age oh, versus a lot of the well, old, yeah there's Teen, a lot of independence ones. but like yeah. the, every stage has its challenges uh i would say this stage overall as far as like the amount of independence is great but then also they're navigating their adolescence and their teenage years and now you know high school and the, it's it's a it's a thing yeah mm. it's a thing it's a, it's a pain in the ass how's oh. your wife doing with it uh, not great. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> well, he can't his own money right. He's got yeah. a job. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no, no. They're, one, they're, they're good kids, mm-hmm. but again, bigger kid. Bigger the kid, the bigger the problem. Like, right. it was it was great when it's like, you know, the biggest hassle is like having to watch them all the time. Yeah. Yeah, true. You know? Now it's like, oh, sure, they can go outside and they can play by themselves. You don't have to really worry about it. Or you can set them off. You yeah, know, they can do their go, morning routine yeah. on the weekend. Right. Yeah, exactly. They can wake up and pour their own bowl of cereal right. and put the TV on or something. Yeah. But Buy cigarettes. I'd much rather do that. <laughs> In hindsight now, I'd much rather do that than some of this other stuff really? that comes with the Oh, yeah. Really? Well, oh, yeah. Are you having to have the talk? What's going on? I mean, there's yeah. all kinds. Of, yeah, it's just like, it's it's parenting, dude. It's uh, parenting. So that's, okay. that's, that's my jeers. I missed yeah. out. Yeah. Uh, uh, Greg Gorey, weekend cheers and jeers. My cheers is also to something that I watched, to show that I told you guys about for the first time ever, called Tulsa King. It's, oh, yeah. yeah. It's back, was, baby. <laughs> wow. And oh, I that, love it. Oh, is it the new season now? <laughs> yeah. It's uh, as of uh, just yesterday. Do you love it ironically? No. Oh, okay. <gasps> I just love it. That's I a great show. It. It's good. New okay. respect for Sly. Is it's that a slam show? funny. No, it's I'm just violent. Curious. Did the, you watch it? I, I saw the first episode and- I, I loved it. I had a Sopran- Greg Soprano's reaction to it. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, it I was is, like, wow. is this really, me. really? It's no, a that's, that's, light. Mm-hmm. That's, that's a show you got to go back to. Okay, I will. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect blend You'll of like funny so and violent. Okay. It rules. And my jeers <laughs> is just kind of how yours is general parenting. Mine is just general anxiety. I have this new anxiety now. That oh, another why, new anxiety <laughs> unlocked? I worry about everything. But now every single time I open the closet or walk to the toilet, I think I'm going to find some sort of giant bug or a snake oh, or something. Oh, wow. So I have to open doors cautiously <clears throat> oh, and no. think like, God, I hope there's not a, a centipede on the floor what? or I hope there's not a spider on the wall. And this is what happens I, when you're in your head constantly. Dude, yeah. I need help. I'm, <laughs> I'm anxious about driving, flying, bugs, and yeah. this is newish. No. Yeah. No, it sounds like uh, you could probably use that mi- that mushroom microdosing. I yeah. need to do that. We have yeah. begged Greg for 
the better part of a decade to see someone about this, and, yeah. he, and he always tells us these stories, and well, then nothing happens. I know. See who? Mm-hmm. Who would he see? A, co- a cognitive behavioral therapist. Oh, oh, therapist. Oh, that's what I went to. And this so would be one of the. This it. is one of the rare cases where a therapist, I would say, is very necessary. And well, I've, I've tried you CBT guys, in the you past. guys tried aversion therapy in here, and it didn't go so well by dangling bugs in front of him. Yeah, that's not that, that's my. That's also for humans. That's exposure <laughs> therapy. <laughs> but you also had this sit and think like oh man my life is so awesome because this is the stuff i actually worry yeah about. that's your biggest oh, agreed. problem yeah. agreed and i've never been in a better mental place i, I know that sounds, <laughs> sounds like it. Yeah. it sounds crazy <laughs> yeah it sounds real crazy i'm happy in general i really am i'm just so anxious <laughs> yeah. all the time yeah <laughs> even my dog had a birthday recently and now i'm anxious about that like oh she's uh-huh. getting old oh this sucks i think because you let yourself mm-hmm. like you don't think about something assess the situation from a realistic standpoint and yeah. move on. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, I tried this CBT um, in the past and they say recognize what you're doing and then change the behavior. Yeah, right. he, he gets on mm-hmm. something wish, and then there he that. sits yeah. Yeah. and he compounds it by thinking about something else mm-hmm. and also sitting with that. Yeah. So it just keeps comp- It snowballs. Yeah, yeah. So right. how will this be different next week, Greg? Uh, it will probably be worse. <laughs> I'll be anxious <laughs> about, well, I don't know. Having something fall from a roof and hit me in the head. You know? okay. <laughs> so you're going to do nothing. All right. I'll, I'll cool. look into it. Uh, you know how easy our insurance is. Seabass weekend. Cheers and jeers. <laughs> well, cheers to the fine folks. Uh, I've said this a couple of times. Trey Parker, Matt Stone, Casa Bonita. Reservations go on sale. Mm-hmm. And uh, lucky, it's in, I might be taking someone for his birthday month when the Ooh. when the early reservations open up next lucky. month. But they're going on sale today. For, like two men, one yeah. hotel room kind of thing? Like, <laughs> yeah, I won't run away. Yeah. Be scared. <laughs> one bed? <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> the toilet's nasty or something. So cheers to them. Uh, Founders Club members. Uh, sale goes on sale today. Uh, Jeers, we, this came up a few weeks ago on, on the internet. They discovered something that us bachelors have known for years is that every male has a, a dirty orange and yellow pillow. Oh, Remember that was a yeah, 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 yellow yeah, yeah. pillow. Yep. Some girl on TikTok figured it out, and yep. all those guys were like, "Yeah, so what?" Yeah, I think most people do. Yeah, yeah. probably. Mm-hmm. And then everybody said, "You got to have a well." Jeers to me because I've had one for years, and I, I have not gotten rid of it forever and ever and ever. It's a great pillow, though, right? Mm-hmm. It was Uh-oh. until it was. today. It, it just oh, over the weekend. You brought it over the yeah, weekend. It got. Right. It wasn't that there was too yellow because it's it's a it's traffic cone orange. <laughs> Sammy's moving <laughs> away. Yeah. But it, it got. It like, started white. It, oh, of course. Yeah, no, this is uh-huh. uh, pearly. Uh, Woody, you'll recognize the brand. Yeah. Simmons Beauty Rest Black. Oh, those are good. Ooh. They sold them in two packs at Costco for the longest <laughs> yeah. time. Ugh. And I'd get new ones every time I was there and they still had them because uh-huh. they're gone now. Oh, no. I got, no. A, I got a stockpile yeah. of them. They were now. great, but the problem is yeah. the, the filling got so like torn up and lumpy yeah. on the inside. Right. Mm-hmm. So I'm finally, jeers to me for t- w- waiting this long to finally get rid of oh, it. Oh, 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 my God. Uh, Dude, that's not really here yours. Here what, Alex? Like, Wait. Oh, <laughs> just put it on Sammy. I put it near Sammy. You touched me. What do you think? Ah! What, do you th- what do you think's on it? Now, Greg's scared of butterflies. It's just like yeah. sweat. What yeah. do you think's yeah. on it? Yeah. Yeah. like dust mites. Uh, no, 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 please, please, please. That, that please, please, looks please. like you got it from an alley somewhere. That looks like it's oh been my peed God. on. He, like, threw it near my face. Get it away from me. And the okay. thing is, I would wash this thing in bleach and throw it in the dryer. And it's, it's still, yeah. it's, it's got these little, like, it's, it's just, urine yellow. So, <laughs> so were, do you not have a pillowcase? I do have a pillowcase. And by the way, you sweat right through them. But yeah, it's it's not even sweat. I think it's just. I don't know, six, eight years. Oh Looks my like God. your hair Crying. dye like that seeped through. Brutal. It's and it's got is like that a hair dye? orangey. No, that, it's just that's, that's what, way more yellow than I thought it would be. Yeah, how does that happen? <laughs> get it away <laughs> from Sammy. She's gonna puke. Did get you pee away. into it or something? Like I don't. No, I, I remember I pooped on my mattress. I don't think yeah. I peed on this. Okay. Uh, no, it's just it's just because I'm not gonna use a pillowcase. Really, say a just liner. Dingy. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's, yeah, there's liners, a, yeah. Well, it's not a liner. It's a, Co- a whatever. protector. Prote- yeah, right. Not, Keep it in protector. that garbage bag you brought it in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I do it. Look, I'm, wearing, I'm using a pillowcase. That's enough. But yeah, I, it's, it? it's, it's fine. Well, <laughs> apparently not. You can see it's, well, not, it's all like lumpy. And... Question. So it went from brand new, perfectly white to like, and mm-hmm. how much time? Like, how old is this pillow? How long is it? It? it might be back to the RV. This might be an eight year old pillow. Oh, oh wow. Eight years old. Oh, my God. Yeah, there's like a. Grease stains on it, like, uh, yeah, you know, like it's, makeup, it's seasoning, makeup, uh, makeup seasoning? Hot from from the chicks. Gina, <laughs> high five. That's right. Yeah, yeah. it's marinated. Yeah, great. Show it up close to Gina. No, well, please. Well, the <laughs> thing is, <laughs> don't shake it at me, please. Well, look, the thing is, when you find a really good pillow, <laughs> yeah, you want to stick with it. You know, I will hang with a good pillow until the very end. Oh. Yeah, I don't know yeah. what those black streaks are from. Oh, those <laughs> has yeah. to be some girl's eyeliner. That's what I said, like mascara. Yeah, Hell yeah, yeah dog. put it in yeah, the corner where the belongs. But again, if he's using a pillowcase through the pillowcase, they slip off. Sammy. 
You're being a little hyperbolic. Is that okay. the word, it's Menace? It's disgusting. Yeah. He is shaking it next to her. Yeah, yeah it's like in my face. It's I know, like, but he didn't have you lick it. And again, I, I mean, what do you, you think? But then Greg is tossing it across the room. It's, <laughs> okay. go, it's flying way too close to my face. Do you stay at hotels? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so that, I, that's a thought that I have every once in a while. I can smell it from like, my seat, God, though. Like, <laughs> it things, may, it does things may look a certain way, but yeah. like God knows what has happened in this room. Pe- put, I, I think of all the people who put their head on that oh. same pillow, even though it's a different pillowcase. Or what like, about these are some of the forks thoughts. at a restaurant? Forks at a restaurant, whatever. Those glasses. Yeah, exactly. But they've so. been cleaned. This doesn't look uh, like it's... Clean. Mm, I agree, it doesn't. Although I, I promise you, I, I, I've, I've thrown it in the wash and dryer a couple times over the years. It okay, looks a exactly. couple times, but, like, yeah. like an eight asylum. Years. But a couple times, but you're a guy who claims <laughs> that he washes his shoes. tennis shoes after every wear. That's because you see them. You see, okay. you see how yeah, you see yeah. the dirt pilled up. This thing's under a pillowcase. Where, like, <laughs> nothing, where the magic room, nothing. Uh, menace weekend. Cheers and jeers. Nothing too crazy. I'll just make it quick. <laughs> Please put <laughs> it back in the brutal. back. No. Uh, well. I was excited because we got paid, so I went shopping, get some clothes, so nice. we don't, you know, we're always like the slobbiest looking group yeah, at true. at the iHeartRadio Festival. <laughs> and we're also the most comfortable. <laughs> yeah, we are. So I, yeah, I just did a, some shopping. I think I found some stuff to wear, so that was good. And then the jeers was, I um, I had some ramen, and I felt, I feel like kind of off ever since, and hmm. I don't know why, but I feel like, not that I'm overall sick, but I feel like... I could throw up at any time. Did you over sodium? That's from I, the ramen? Yeah. That's I don't know I why. I don't know what over sodium means. Like, well, there's a lot of but... salt. Sodium. There's a I lot think of I do sodium the, did you use, I think did that... you use the entire packet? Yeah. It's Is it one question. of those where you have to add the seasoning? No, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. He went to a fancy No, no yeah, like I went to a ramen place. I went to a ro- yeah, uh, ramen place. Oh, oh then yeah, you, yeah. you totally got sick. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's food poisoning. Yeah. Yeah, but no, I mean, you know, I'm not like bedridden or anything like that. I just feel like. In my throat, I feel like I'll throw up at any, it could go any, way. any moment. Yeah, yeah. But you, you definitely Sammy, make sure there. you stand close. Oh, yeah. good. But you love throwing up. Just block it with spot. the pillow. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you could lie yeah. down on the pillow. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Sammy, weekend cheers and jeers. My cheers is to canceled plans. Friday and Saturday had plans canceled. Had a totally chill weekend. Up top, Rep. Sammy. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. And my jeers is to my Pick'ems League. I'm in a NFL Pick'ems League. We've been doing it for about a decade, and it's just you you pick who wins straight right, up. Straight up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's no line, no. Right, yeah. no nothing. And we all got over half of the picks wrong. Everybody across the board. I don't know what happened in the NFL this week, but over half of them. I mean, the person who's going to win probably got like eight picks wrong. It was so weird. It's never happened in a decade. I don't know what went on yesterday? So did you get knocked game. out? Is it, or is that it? Is it like, a, like it's not Survivor, no, right? No, it's not Survivor. We just do it every week. We oh, okay. pay five bucks and we do it every week. And no, the winner you're fine. gets them all. It's, it sucks when right. you're uh, knocked out of Survivor yeah. this early. And that's that. Week two and you're done. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah. All right. What do you win? Is it just like a you weekly win the pot, thing? So everyone puts in $5 and whoever wins gets all the money. All right, so it's every not week. like at the end of the season, whoever had the most wins no. gets like all that money. No, it's just okay. every week. Oh, so you're what, out five bucks? Wildlife. Yeah, no. like, yeah. It's not a big deal, but it was just so weird. We've yeah. never had everybody do that bad on the same day. Yeah. Makes it exciting. All right. Yeah. Uh, if it was real money on the line for Greg, he'd be vomiting like menace. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I no ramen like, needed. I would look right. like that pillow. Uh, Gina Grad, weekend cheers and jeers. It was a good weekend. Again, canceled plans. Love those. Uh, went a uh, couple five-mile walks. Uh, had a, a, a all good times. But my cheers is... Cheers? I, no, my cheers. Oh, I thought that was no, the just, cheers. That was just the preliminary. Oh, but oh, oh this the is official what to- cheers. This is what mm. topped it. I had the best brat I can remember ever having. Oh, yeah. Okay. I love brats. Yeah, me too. And, and good this beer had, brat. Oh, and it was just piled high with sauerkraut and and spicy mustard, mm. and it made my day. That was my cheers. Was it just a regular brat, or was it some kind of like a uh, particular flavor? No, it was they just make, a, there. There was one butcher shop, man, I would go to, and they had at any given time sixty different varieties. What of of Ooh. brats? I yeah. love the ones just that are regular. Yeah. A what? The white ones? Have like what, like oh, a chicken one? Oh, no, I, know. I know what you're talking about. Those are from like a real German deli. Yeah, yeah. those are good. This was just a straight up beer brat, and it was perfect, and it made my weekend. Jeers, you guys ever seen a racer head? I've heard the David of it. Lynch movie from 1977. Oh, a racer head. I, I know the haircut. I know of it. That was the dumbest bullish I've ever seen in my life. 
I had to see what what all the fuss was about. It is so dumb. Yeah, and I think David Lynch is one of those guys who's weird for the sake of being weird. Absolutely, totally. and I like, get it. I don't know if, how authentic it is. Well, and he's hit or miss because he's you know Twin Peaks and all this great yeah. stuff and whatever. But this was like, and I get it. Back in the day, maybe this was groundbreaking. It was so stupid that I couldn't <laughs> believe people freak out and, and bow at the knee of David Lynch for a racer head. Don't waste your time. What's the, th- uh, the plot real quick? It's this dude in this like surreal world who knocks up this crazy chick and they have like a skinless alien baby. Ooh. And that's not even the weird stuff that happens in this movie. It's just it's just bizarre for bizarre's sake. Yeah. So bad. I hate it when people try to sell you on a movie that they know is weird. Totally. They know is dumb. Like but Donnie Darko. It makes them seem like cool. cooler, yeah, kind of. Like, like if indeed. they're like if you you're know, in college, I get it, but like get over it. Was there a was it a Bill Murray movie where something about a hotel or what was the name? Oh, of that? Uh, um, with the Lost, Sophia Lost Coppola. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was that what it was Lost called? In yeah, translation. Lost in Translation. Yeah. Yeah. Not as good. <sighs> was that dumb? Yeah. Like and everyone's like, oh, and I, I'm like, oh, I like a lot of these people that are in it, whatever. Like Sorry, so I'm like, what am I watching? Yeah. Get over yourself. <laughs> yeah, and you're like Donnie Darko's. And I'm like, what, oh, like so huh? dumb. What am I doing? People lie. <laughs> Very they confusing like it. movie. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. Anyway, well, uh, hey, I hope you had a great weekend, everybody. Cheers, cheers. We get cheers and jeers. Bye, bye.